There are police escorts bringing out log truck after log truck after log truck from some of the jewels of our shared heritage, some of our precious water catchments, home to species that have gone from being common 30 years ago that are now endangered. Species like the greater glider. In uh, the forest near where I live, in Bulga Forest, we went out spotlighting two weeks ago. We found in the patch of forest that has been uh, not as badly burnt as much of the other forests, we found 60 greater gliders. It's an absolute amazing number. It's more than anywhere else on the North Coast has been found since the fires. And the ecologist said, surely this means that this patch of forest will be saved. But no, it doesn't mean that at all, because the spin is, we do world's best practice forestry in New South Wales. It's perfectly sustainable. The trees have gone from being giants to being this big, but hey, it's still sustainable. We are here to tell the Prime Minister, end, end native forest logging. New Zealand did, did this 23 years ago, at the turn of the century. It is high time that we did it as well. It is high time that Prime Minister Albanese started to put people and the planet above corporate profits and above industry lobbies. You know, governments across Australia are more interested in cracking down on activists, in policing and putting in jail activists who are putting their life on the line, their bodies on the line to save this planet while they're completely abrogating their responsibility to keep people and the planet safe, to tackle the climate crisis and the extinction crisis with the urgency and the profoundness that it demands. I've just come back from the front lines at Newry State Forest where this current state means government promised all of New South Wales a great koala national park. Yeah. It was the one yeah. promise that this Labor government was elected. And shamefully, the New South Wales Minns Labor government are, are complete laggards, stubborn laggards. And they will be the ones to blame. They will be the ones to blame if they don't take urgent action right now for the extinction of our iconic koalas. And that's the reason, that's the reason why the federal government has to come to the table and put a complete nationwide ban on native forest logging. Yeah.